as Donald Trump's presidency continues to drag on and becomes more disastrous and destructive, even those closest to the tweeter-in-chief are concerned about what's yet to come, especially as Trump crumbles under the pressure of the upcoming 2020 election and Robert Mueller's investigation. This couldn't have been more apparent than when Vanity Fair's Gabriel Sherman released a damning report a while ago, stating that Trump was having one of the most dramatic meltdowns of his presidency. Trump's anger and panic was caused by Bob Woodward's new book Fear, Trump in the White House, and it was so intense that his entire family and aides were paralyzed with fear and concern for the unraveling POTUS. Since then, things have only gotten worse. Following a terrible morning in which Trump blasted Woodward's book repeatedly, Trump threw a silent temper tantrum. Sherman reported that Trump isn't talking to anyone, as the president was furious about the leaked info in the book. What a source told Sherman painted a very disturbing picture of what's happening in the White House right now. Woodward's book triggered Trump's wrath on several levels. Two sources told me Trump is furious at the portions of the book that describe administration officials questioning his intelligence and emotional stability. Woodward reports that Chief of Staff John Kelly called Trump an idiot and the West Wing crazy town, Defense Secretary Jim Mattis compared Trump to a fifth or sixth grader, and Trump's former personal lawyer called Trump a fucking liar who would end up in an orange jumpsuit if he testified to special counsel Robert Mueller. Sherman noted that Trump is also outraged that the book portrays aides as believing they are the grown-ups protecting the country from his dangerous impulses. And in a surprising change of heart, the president blamed the book's publication on White House special counselor Kellyanne Conway, despite all her dedication to lying for him. Sherman quoted one White House staffer, Trump's unhinged, antisocial behavior got to the point where his family was extremely worried about his declining mental health. Sherman reported, the crazy thing is, so many more tell-all books have come out since then, and Trump has only become more unhinged with every release. Trump cannot take much more of this, and now would be a really great time for the Republican Party to step up and bring forth concerns about Trump's mental stability. Unfortunately, we all know that spineless gopers don't have it in them to protect the country while Trump melts down.